with the official cut of the ribbon. Yes. Thank you. The Gyro Integrated Physiological Trainer, or Gyro IPT2, was unveiled at Joint Base San Antonio Randolph on Tuesday, June 7th. This modern spatial disorientation flight trainer Your call sign is Tango 62. offers a very realistic environment for individuals who are learning to fly or have flown the T-6. To have the visual reference where it's as if you're actually flying, you have a stick in your hand, you have pedals, you have commands coming at you, you have to maintain altitude, maintain bank, and then to experience the spatial disorientation while trying to do all of that, it just takes it totally to the next level. Zero, two, zero, 8,000 feet? Correct. For me, being only in the T6 a couple of times, I'd say it's pretty, pretty accurate in terms of some of the feelings I've had flying real world. The Aerospace and Operational Physiology Flight, part of the 59th Medical Wing, headquartered at JBSA Lackland, houses the Spatial Disorientation Flight Trainer. You and your instructor are performing spin recovery exercises. It provides pilot instructor trainees with hands-on experience using this technology. And whenever you're ready, go ahead and hit run. Roger. Empowering them to prepare new student pilots for the physiological rigors of being in the air and responding accordingly. To recover from the spin, apply full opposite rudder, neutralize the controls then neutralize the rudder and recover from the dive. When we talk about stability and balance, things that are happening in the middle ear, that's the real goal. Put them in here and have them experience what they could possibly experience in flight. Did you feel the strong left turning sensation? Yeah. <laughs> the trainer communicates directly with pilots, offering helpful information and education on how their senses might be affected. You have just experienced one instance of the night false horizon illusion. The trainer also allows flight members to interact with pilots. All right, we're just turning the lights back on out here and we're going to set you up for another one. Monitor any physiological symptoms they might be experiencing and offer suggestions on overcoming those challenges. And now this is where they show you the actual ADI and you recover to wings level. Kind of cool, huh? Yeah. The ultimate goal of the Gyro IPT2 is to expose pilots to a variety of dangerous scenarios things they could potentially experience in flight without ever leaving the ground. It's an excellent tool, hands down, one of the, the best sims that we probably could have purchased and is gonna, probably going to do a lot to help save lives probably in the future. In the coming months, members of the 59th Medical Wing will receive on-the-job training or OJT on the administration of various simulations. Once their OJT is complete, They'll train close to 200 T6 instructor pilot trainees each year on this high-tech spatial disorientation trainer. From the 502nd Air Base Wing Public Affairs Office, I'm Sean Schroeder. All right, sir, you are cleared for takeoff.